<laughs> Same here. All right, Facebook BeFit Nation, welcome to your Motivation Monday, where we have your full total body workout covered. I'd like to introduce my guest, Senior Master Sergeant Barry. How are you, ma'am? Hi, good morning, Murray. I'm doing good. I'm hungry right. already, though, so <laughs> after the workout. <laughs> Absolutely, yes, ma'am. You know, I'm, I am as well. It's, it's a little cooler, a little breezy, so forgive a little bit of the wind, but here's how you know it's live because you hear all the elements outside. These workouts are programmed to be uh, a full body workout where we can accomplish in a little as space as possible. So I'm here at my home, Sergeant Barry as well, indoors, I'm outdoors. We are both tackling this workout together uh, as a team and um, with you all, we will all do this together. So what a great day it is to have a great day and know what no better a way than to kick off our week nice and strong with this programmed workout. So we are doing four workouts at 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest with one minute rest in between each round, okay? So what's nice about this program is that not only do we accomplish our full total body, but we also are working with time. We're working with the time and not, a, not, a, not with reps. So it allows you to go at your own pace, uh, to focus on your form, to focus on uh, the things that you need to take care of <clears throat> to uh, tackle this workout here. So um, let's go ahead and, and I'll, I'll name out the workout, the exercises for us for today. Again, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds with one minute uh, in between each round. Okay, so first on deck, we we're gonna have air squats. So our foundation will be of air squats. Our second will be a three repetition of close grip our standard medium grip and our wide grip push-ups to really focus and tackle our, our full pectoral muscle here. Our third will be cross back lunges. And then our fourth will be crab toe touches. This one's gonna be a little bit more fun here. So again, I'll demonstrate uh, the four exercises here, a little bit of keys, and then we will go into some stretching here. So air squats, again, we, we, we know these here, we know this team, air squats, feet are shoulder width apart, and we are sitting back in our squatting position here to target that lower body for us. Okay, close grip, medium grip, wide grip, our standard push-up. We will get down on deck here, close grip to really accent the tricep here, and our standard grip, chest to deck here, and then our wide grip to really focus on the outside of our pectoral muscle here. Our cross back lunges, again, just like our, our, our normal lunge here, but let me face towards you here. And let me see if you can't get down on my feet here. Okay, feet are together. And we want to really accentuate our left leg crossing over our body here and coming down into that reverse lunge. So cross back lunge here, again, with our right leg swinging back. It's coming all the way over that center plane here, and we are down into a lunge. Okay, you're gonna feel that sweeping uh, quad right here. You'll feel that isolation right there on that leg. And the crab toe touches, a little bit different, a little fun here. So we are gonna get down on the floor here. Hands are gonna be underneath our shoulders. And we'll start off first with taps here, okay? So we're just gonna raise left foot, right foot, tapping the floor here. And then once we get comfortable here, you're gonna really wanna embrace and uh, contract that core. We'll extend out to our toe touches where you see comfortable, okay? Nice and slow, nice and controlled, really forcing us to balance and stabilize and utilize our core. Sound good? Sound good. <laughs> Looks like a lot of fun. All right. <laughs> yes, ma'am, absolutely. All right, and that's the name of the game here is to have a lot of fun while we work, while we break a sweat here. So before we get started, we'll jump into some stretching. So dynamic stretches here. Again, we are looking to prime our bodies, get our bodies 
nice and warm, get some blood flow moving to the to the right areas. So let's start off with some some um, some leg reaches here. Okay. We'll do these exercises for about 30 seconds each at your pace, kind of feeling out your body. Nice and slow. Really working on opening up our hips here. I know I've had a pretty active weekend. So this is just a nice part of the time of our workout where I can focus on how my body's going to react today to today's workout. Get it nice and warm. One more here, and then we will go into our reverse lunge reaches. Since we have some lunge work for today, we are going to come up to the top of our mat as if we were on a mat. We are going to lunge back, extending all the way up and reaching over, feeling that stretch, that nice stretch in our lats, as well as warming up those hips, the glutes. Really telling our body, hey, let's wake up. We got some work to do today. Working on engaging that core for stabilization. There we go. Two more here. <laughs> As I almost lose my balance. There we go. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Let's let's move into some alternating feet lateral lunges here. So we're gonna take a wide stance here, and we are just gonna hand hands on the quads here, and we're just gonna comfortably lateral lunge here from left to right. So right here, we're working on that. You'll feel that inner stretch in your thigh. You'll feel some blood flow moving towards those legs. Quads. Nice, nice. Good work. A few more here. These are feeling good for me. Can you try this? <laughs> All right, let's go into some hinge reaches here. We're going to take a shoulder width stance here, soft bend at the knees. Arms are all the way up, and we are hinging at the hips. So you're hinging at the hips at 45 degrees, and then coming back up, okay? Feel that stretch in our hamstring, glutes, lower body here, your lower back, a little bit of shoulder mobility here, your arms above your head. Nothing too fast, there we go. Nice and easy here. Again, really scanning the body here. You're looking for different areas that you may be tight. And really trying to work that out. Let's shake that out. And our last and final dynamic stretch here will be YTWs. Let me see if I can show I have you in my, my finder here. Big Y here. Hands are going to be your shoulder width apart. Hands are close to your body here. We're gonna go up into a Y. Nice long stretch into a Y. Back to center. All the way out into a T. Just feel that stretch in your shoulders. All the way back to center. And let's make that W here. Just feel that traction in the back, upper back here. Back to center. Let's do two more reps of these here. Y, Y, T, W, T. Creative name, I know. T. <laughs> and now uh, let's make that W. Bringing those shoulder blades together. One more set here. Y. There we go. You should feel some blood flow in those shoulders. Nice, nice. And that W. Nice big W. Show off those guns. There we go. All right. Feeling warm, feeling warm, BFIT Nation. If you are just joining us, we just ran through some dynamic stretching to get ready for our workout. Again, we are working 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, four rounds, four exercises with one minute, uh, one minute break, one minute rest in between each round. So 
and grab your water, grab your towel. Now is a perfect time to stay hydrated and grab a drink, towel off. I'm gonna start my timer here. And we will kick things off with air squats for our first exercise. I hope everyone had a great weekend and has come to work. All right, air squats in 10. Shake this off here. Air squats in five, two, one. Okay, let's work. Our feet are shoulder width apart and we are sitting back in that imaginary chair as deep as our comfort level allows us to sit back, okay? make sure our chest is nice and proud, nice and forward. Our head is looking straight ahead. We wanna make that imaginary relatively straight line with our spine, our back is flat. Focusing on pushing in, pushing out through those heels and hitting those quads. Five seconds left, three, two, one, and rest. 20 seconds of rest here. And our favorites here, we're gonna get down on the floor for some push-up action. All right, we have close grip. Again, three reps of close grip, three reps of standard grip, and three reps of your wide grip in five, four, three, two, and let's work here. Close grip, one, two, three. Your standard push-up, one, chest to the neck there. Three, and let's take a big wide stance here. Fingers should face a little forward out. <laughs> Actually away from me, all right. And if you need to regress here, feel free and come down to those knees to tackle these. All right, five more seconds of work. Already done with those last reps and time. Good work. Good work, good work, team. Good work, Sergeant Bay. Good work. Good yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right, cross back lunges in five. They look like this. Cross back lunges in two, one, top of the mat, let's go. All right, these are a little tricky here. Really embrace and engage that core to keep your center, to keep your balance. Okay, let's go at our own pace here. Reaching all the way back. You'll feel that contraction in that quad as you cross over. 10 more seconds of work here. Power through, through that heel, push up, through that glute. Two, one, and time. Good work. Good work, good work. All right, here's for the fun crab toe touches. This round we learn it. Second round we'll make it more challenging. So we're here on the ground in five. Our hands are gonna be directly underneath our shoulders. And we're working here. This round, let's just tap here. Let's get our body nice and warm. Learning this exercise. Again, we're working on engaging our core. So think about bringing that belly button towards your spine. 20 seconds here. Try bringing those knees closer to your chest. With one foot on the floor, it really forces your body to stabilize here. Five more seconds. Keep it going. Two, one. All right. Time, one minute rest here. All right, first round we learned it. <laughs> Let's see what we can do to, to up the game here, up the game. All right. Be fit nation, how are we doing? Where are we watching from? Let me know where you're watching from. Let me know if any of these, any of these exercises, let me know if you've tackled them before. Let me know if any one of them are your favorite, which one looks the most challenging? Let me know. <laughs> Again, air squats are going to be up next. We're going to add a little bit of a load. 
just a little bit. 15 seconds of rest here, towel off, grab your water, hydrate. Are you enjoying the fresh air? I am. Five seconds of rest here. Let's get ready. Two, one, I'm rocking. Air squats, I'm working here. There we go. Let's make sure and sit back in that imaginary chair. Glutes lead the way here, all the way back. Thrust up through those heels, push up to those heels and up to those quads. All right, to your comfort level here, as deep as you can to your comfort. 10 seconds of work here, seven seconds left, five, four, two, one, time. Good work, good work, B-Fit Nation. Good work, Sergeant Barry, I see you. Putting in that work. We're on the deck next in seven for our close, medium, and wide grip. Three more seconds here, two, one. All right, let's work. Again, starting with our close grip here. You should feel that accentuate through your tricep. Our chest is hitting the deck, keeping those hips up. There we go. 14 more seconds here. Let's get it. Seven more seconds. Finish off strong. Two, one, time. Good work, good work. Those are not easy. Those are not easy. And don't forget, we need to scale it back a little. That's fine. Come off, come off your knees. That'll be perfectly fine. All right. 20 seconds are flying by. Time for our cross back lunges in two, one. All right, let's work here. All right, let me know if you feel this on the outside of that quad, that sweep on your quad. <laughs> there we go. 18 more seconds of work here. If you feel any pain in your knee from this movement, go ahead and not go as far over, maybe come back and regress just a little bit to keep that pain off your knee. Two, one, and time. Good work. All right. Here's from my favorite. <laughs> All right, crab toe touches here or taps. You can stay on taps or the touches here. 40 seconds of work. Let's go. Ah, there we go. That was the wind. It blew me over. <laughs> All right. Again, let's make sure that our hands are directly under our shoulders for support. Keeping that core engaged as you extend up and trying to touch that toe. <laughs> more challenging than it looks. Eight more seconds of work here. Good work. Five, two, one, time. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Those are very humbling. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. You feel a little bit of that shoulder action, so. How are we feeling? I know you mentioned food. We are definitely working up an appetite here. <laughs> Speaking of food, <laughs> I hope everyone is limiting their sugar intake if you can. Let's work on those balanced meals to round out our health and wellness for this week. Again, I'm aiming for proteins, carbs, and veggies. That's usually what my meal consists of. Just like that, a minute is done. Air squats coming up. Three, two, one, I'm loaded up. And 
I'm working here. Again, your feet should be a little wider than shoulder width apart. Squatting down to your comfort and extending all the way to the top. There we go. Making sure you squeeze those glutes at the top. Nice. 10 more seconds of work here. Five, four, three, two, one. And time. Good work. Good work, BFIT Nation. Are you with me? Are you with me? Let me know. Are you on these push ups in five? All right, here we go. Close grip, medium grip, wide grip. Again, if you need to regress and scale back down to your knees, let's do it. Medium grip for me. Good, good, good. Wide. Nice and controlled. Nice and smooth here. Feeling the burn here. <laughs> there we go. In five, four more seconds. Push through. One and time. Good work. Stretching that one out. Shaking that one out. Solid round. And we're back up top for those cross back lunges. Top of the mat. We're starting in three, two, one, and time. If you have the option to add resistance for this third round, feel free. Let's challenge yourselves. It doesn't challenge us, it doesn't change us. That's what I always say. Nice model for me. Keeps me pushing, keeps me working. 13 more seconds left here. Let's get back. All right, Em. <laughs> Five more seconds. Two, one, and time. Good work. That was not easy. That one is not easy. All right, let's get down. Let's get down to business with these crab toe touches. <laughs> Only time we're sitting today. And them up. Glutes are up. Arms are up. Legs are extending. We're working here. 40 seconds of work. Third round. We're cruising through. Extending that leg. Extending that arm. Keeping that balance. Keeping your core. Nice and tight. There you go. Let's focus on a little movement of those hips. Three, oh, five more seconds. A little bit ahead. Three, two, one, and time. <laughs> I know, I know. They look fine until you try them. <laughs> We've earned one minute rest to get ready for our last round. Our last and final round to round out this workout. It doesn't take much, it doesn't take much time. It just takes a lot of effort. As much effort as you put in will pay off in the long run. It's all about effort. If you don't have dumbbells, let's hold that gallon of water, anything with a handle. Your body doesn't know that this isn't a dumbbell. <laughs> All right, five seconds here. Air squats coming up. Two, one, let's work here. There we go. Nice and controlled at your pace here, to your comfort level. We've tackled air squats before, so let's build on them. 
That's what it's about here at BFit Nation. How are you doing? Let me know. 10 more seconds of work here. Five, four, one, last rep. Ah, nice. Time. All right, 14 seconds of rest here. And we're on the floor here. Five seconds here. Four. I'm down. And we're pushing here. 40 seconds here. Last round. There we go. Last round, best round. <laughs> Let's make it happen, team. Let's push through. Push through <laughs> on these push-ups. Here we go. Let's try and keep that back relatively straight. Nine more seconds here. Finish out strong. Last set. Finish out those three reps. Two. <laughs> nice. Work, on <laughs> awesome work, awesome work. Halfway through. Cross back lunges coming up in five. Time's flying. Can't believe it. All right, 20 seconds. Let's work here. Nice. As the uh -oh. wind hits me. Blown away. <laughs> there we go. We're all good here. 20 seconds of work here. Coming up, halfway there. Making our way home stretch here. Let's finish off, 10 more seconds. Five, feeling that burn in the quad, in your glutes. Two, one, last rep, and time. Good work. Awesome work. <laughs> awesome work. 10 seconds here. Right, 10 seconds. Our last and final exercise for today. On the ground, two, one. Let's work here. Stabilize yourself. Refocus at your own pace. Last round. <laughs> Last exercise, halfway there, 20 seconds. We can push the tempo. Let's do it. Finish out. Reach, touch those toes, 10 more seconds here. Extending that leg, extending the arm, keeping that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Two, one, and time. <laughs> Good work. Good work, good work. <laughs> How are we doing? How are we doing? How are we doing, team? I know that was a tough one. So what's great again, what's great about these workouts is we're tackling our total body. And believe it or not, just under 20 minutes of work, we have another 10 or so roughly for some dynamic stretching to warm up our bodies. And then 20 minutes of work with limited rest. That's the key, limited rest will keep your heart elevated, keep you burning calories an extended period of time long after our workouts here. As I catch my breath. <laughs> what I love working at home is all the extra natural elements. Like, I don't know if you saw my cat in my face when I was trying to do push ups, <laughs> and then your mat Absolutely. blowing away. So, <laughs> makes it a little extra Absolutely. fun, right? <laughs> of course, of course. These little challenges that we uh, get to work around makes it fun. Uh, you know, if I had a pet, I think I would work out with my pet all the time. <laughs> Good workout, teammate. Would... Right, right. <laughs> But that's so awesome. Um, again, yeah, you know, having a pet is, is so great. And it, it almost forces you to stay active just a little bit more. So, um, you know, that's, that's, that's awesome for, for those that have pets. 
you know, take that walk. You know, if it's, if it's one time around the block, let's make it two this week. Let's try and advance a little bit more activity into our week. And then, you know, let's progress from there. Stay strong. Awesome work. Yeah, that was a really good workout. It was extra challenging, but it's always more rewarding at the end. You're like, oh, I'm done. I made it through. Absolutely. Now I get to and eat lunch. What, <laughs> <laughs> and that's what it's about. That's what it's about. Teamwork, partnership. You know, having you here, Sergeant Barry, it's just uh, it's it's just that extra additive of having someone to keep you accountable as far as a workout partner goes. Um, you know, I, I see you working out twice as hard. And, and so I'm like, okay, let me get those last reps in. And that's so great about a, a partner to keep yourself accountable, whether it's a, a partner, a friend, uh, you know, a, a spouse or, or, or brother or sister, anything like that, family member. Um, that's, that's what's great about having that teamwork. So again, I highly encourage, highly encourage teamwork. <laughs> And uh, here's, here's a quick shout out for all the women. Uh, September 30th, this Wednesday, is National Women's Fitness, Women's Health and Fitness Day. So it's important uh, to bring awareness to your physical fitness and health. So this Wednesday, I, um, I applaud all the, the, the women and service members. And, um, you know, let's just let's keep going. Um, you know, it, it's important to, to keep aware of your body and aware of your physical and mental health and wellness. So uh, I, I celebrate you this Wednesday. <laughs> and Sergeant Barry, you're right there. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Girl power, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. It is important, though, absolutely. just to really be proud of yourself for the, your accomplishments, too. I think we get caught up in aesthetic or something else, but just to remind mm -hmm. yourself that when you're healthy and active, you're really doing something great for yourself. So. Absolutely. It's all a part of uh, staying ready, staying resilient, yeah. and, um, you know, keeping the fight. Uh, those small wins, those small steps forward can amount up to and add up to those larger steps, you know, of your goal, uh, it, progress leaning forward. So that's what it's about. So yes, ma'am. Absolutely. <laughs> well, Be Fit Nation, let us know how you did. Let us know what exercises you liked. Again, we're here every Monday at 11 a.m. Uh, Central Standard Time. Uh, join us, please. Uh, let us know how you're doing. Let us know how you've progressed. A 30-minute window here uh, to focus on yourself, and that's what it takes. Uh, so, again, four exercises, four rounds, 30 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. It's quick. It's fast. It goes by fast. But it's, it's enjoyable, and, um, you know, you will thank your body will thank you later <laughs> so <laughs> all out. have have a uh, great week be fit nation stay safe stay healthy stay strong <laughs>